years ago I had a PA in this great commission and she was apparently barren. Then she got pregnant in England. Suddenly they said there was no more pregnancy. It was missed abortion she had. Over 40. To cut it short, she came to my house one day and said, Pastor, ah, she has pain all over her back. Her stomach is hard. And I said, ah, I don't know about fibro, though. My mind went to fibro. Have you done pregnancy? They said she did it. They said there's nothing there. To cut it short anyway, to cut it short, 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 short. She never knew she was pregnant until the day she delivered. I'm telling you, real life. She said she was tired, but she was eating a lot, more than before. The test did not show pregnancy. She was jumping up and down. But one thing she never stopped doing, she catered for the children of her friends. She had chocolates in her fridge. She had biscuits when children came. She was paying, offering for herself and the unborn child she was expecting. She was paying tithe for unborn child she never saw. So she went, see, she went to see her doctor in Abuja. And the doctor said, it looks as if she has a cyst. I was in camp doing Holy Ghost service. And her husband suddenly called me. Because when she got there, the doctor said, we're going to do a final test. If the cyst is there, we'll need to cut you open and bring it out. But they put some machine on her stomach. In the meantime, the pain behind her back was unbearable. And they were hearing the heartbeat of a child. Of a child. What happened was, the womb went to the back. Yes. An old woman also said she had heard that story just once. God put the womb at the back. The doctors did not know. The one kind of pregnancy did not know. I was talking about five broad myself, a pastor. She was taking codeine. You don't take codeine when you know you are pregnant. She was downing codeine. When they heard the heartbeat, the husband called me from Abuja and said, please pray for my wife. They say she wants to deliver. I said, deliver what? She must have just conceived. So there's miscarriage. And I wanted to pray for a miscarriage. Before I could start praying, the husband called me again and said, they say they're twins. I'm telling you. Hallelujah. That's how she... But when she got there, the doctor said she was too stiff. So she has to be walking up and down. She took a video of herself walking up and down to losing up. When she brought forth, no section, no CS, no surgery... The womb now came back to where it should be. And she brought forth God of multiple wonders. Somebody shout hallelujah.